Hey Sunshines, it's Christy and welcome back and thanks for popping in. So for today's video, I have not one but two authentic book boxes to share with you. Unfortunately, last month I didn't get around to opening the box. I just ran out of month and so this month we're going to do a double whammy. I think it's really helpful, especially if you're on the fence about subscribing to a box to see multiple months worth of unboxings. That way you're able to compare them. You're able to get a better idea of the vibe of the box and the types of things that are consistently in the box. So that's what we're going to do today. This is a book subscription box and every month on the first, and don't worry, she sends a reminder. Thank you because I'm sure just like me, the rest of you guys need a reminder too. On the first, you will go in and you have from the first to the fifth to pick one of the new releases. She does a really good job of picking different genres. There might be one that's more of a dark and twisty thriller. There may be one that's a little bit more of a mystery. And then there might be one that's more like chit lit or rom-com. Those are usually the ones that I go for. But if you have trouble picking in June, I struggled between two books. There were two books that I just really gravitated to. If that works for you um, too, then you can add a second book into your box at a discounted rate, which is really a great idea. So she has three ways to subscribe. You can pick a $39.99 box, a $49.99 box, or a $59.99 box. And the box is really supposed to tickle all of your senses, your sight, your taste, your touch, things like that. So I have the $59.99 boxes to open with you, but I'm able to tell you what's in each tier. So in the $39.99 box, you're going to get your sight item, which is always your book. You're going to get a smell item, which is your candle, and all of her candles are made in-house. You're going to get a touch item, which is a self-care item. We've had everything from body scrubs to bath soaks to a really cute a pedicure kit, really interesting things, and they're all done by small businesses. Then you're going to get a Spotify playlist based on the book that you choose. So she's gonna do one for each of the three books. You're gonna get a heart item. It's not really an item, but you get the benefit of knowing that 5% of the proceeds actually go to help children's literacy projects. You're going to get a custom bookmark for your particular book that you choose, as well as a recipe card with recipes or craft cocktail recipes that are directly from your book. So that's in the $39.99 book or box. The $49.99 box is going to have all of that. Plus they're going to give you either a gourmet tea or a craft cocktail mixer. And if you're not a drinker, trust me, you could make them non-alcoholic and they are fabulous. They are cocktail mixers that look like you get them in a really like upscale gourmet food store. And then you get a second self-care item. Again, that's from a small business. And then if you choose the $59.99 box, you're going to get all of that Plus you're gonna get a gourmet chocolate. And y'all, this isn't a 99 cent uh, Hershey bar from CVS. I like those too. But these are like craft chocolate bars made from gorgeous chocolatiers all around the US. I mean, they are like mouthwateringly good. And then you're also gonna get a third self-care item. Now some books, unfortunately, just go straight to paperback. So if you get a paperback book, even though they're new releases, she actually puts an extra item in your box for you. And I did not realize this. I met her at conference and she said that she actually lets you guys vote on the third item that will be in the box. So if you follow her on social media, you can get in on the voting. So we're going to go ahead and dive in. I do have a discount code for this box, which I'm going to link down below. And she's gracious enough to send these boxes to me for review. So I'm able to share them with you. If you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'd love to have you join us over here. I do all kinds of clothing and unboxing videos, as well as a little bit of lifestyle. So hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you're notified when I upload new videos. And we're just going to get started with this one. I haven't received my June box because um, she ships the last week of the month. So usually I get mine around the first of the month. So if you subscribe to this box, you will um, start with the July box and you'll get it at the end of July or the first of August. Okay. So when you open it up, it looks like this. Really, really pretty. And this was my April unboxing. This is Lessons in Chemistry. 
that's the book that I chose. And remember, I like the lighter fare. I'm at a time of my life where I just went easy breezy, but if you're looking for something a little different, a little dark and twisty, then you can get that too. It says, a delight for readers of Where'd You Go Bernadette and the Marvelous Mrs. Maisel. This blockbuster debut set in 1960s California features the singular voice of Elizabeth Zott, a scientist whose career takes a detour when she becomes the star of a beloved TV cooking show. Oh, that sounds interesting, doesn't it? Okay, and here is my bookmark. Now remember, she does a custom bookmark for each book that you do. It says, chemistry has changed. Design your own future. When you go home today, ask yourself, what will you change? And then get started. So this is a quote from the book. That's actually a really great thing. If you're a journaler, a junk journaler, this would be really great to put in there. Okay, let's dive in. The book is usually at the bottom, so I'll show you that last. So here's the candle. And like I said, they make them in house every time. These candles do not give me a headache and they're so pretty. She usually puts something on the top of these candles um, that just make them gorgeous. So this one says it's got a chemistry problem on it. C6H807. It's a sharp and clean candle. Ooh, it's got a lemon scent. It's a very fresh, clean scent. This is what it looks like, and you can see the little rock. She put, sometimes she'll do seashells if the book takes place at the beach, or sometimes she'll do like little pine if the book takes place in the mountains. Um, so that is our candle this time. They have a really great burn time too. So it says, it has notes of lemongrass and light musk. Our candles are always hand stirred and poured in the authentic book box studio using non-toxic ingredients. Okay, and then this time, I think I might have got the craft cocktail. I'm happy um, with whatever she sends me, but when you sign up, you can actually pick. Um, she just sends me um, whatever. I think her hand tips first. So let's see what this is. Ooh, isn't this gorgeous? Do you not see this sitting on like a fancy gourmet food shop shelf? This is a strawberry lemon lime syrup. Oh, this would be really good in like a lemonade, wouldn't it? You do not have to make this into a cocktail if you're not a drinker. Yum. Okay, so it says, we're bringing you back, or we're bringing you back to the summers of your youth. All the hot pink strawberry lemonade flavors, but with 40% less sugar. This syrup mixes well with vodka to give your lemonade a real kick. Or you could have received a loose leaf tea that was a Chinese Ooh, gunpowder tea with mint. I love gunpowder tea. Okay, so either one would have been great. Okay, the next thing in here, we have a set of pencils. Oh, these are like inspirational. One of them says, do math like a girl. I love that. It's as easy as pi, but it's P-I. Um, Stem-tastic. Engineer like a girl. Science. And I have chemistry. <laughs> And Earth's rotation makes a day. Are these like STEM? I feel like these have like a STEM feel to them. Science, technology, math, engineering. Yes, it says girls in STEM pencil pouch. It says number two hex pencils, gold foil imprint. Each pack contains six pencils. Pencils in the girls in STEM pack are assorted colors and read, do math like a girl. It's as easy as pie. Oh, stem -netist engineer like a girl, and science and I have chemistry. That is so cute. I love that. Okay. The next item in here is our chocolate bar. Oh, she has me at pistachios. This is a dark chocolate pistachios and sea salt. This company, we have had chocolate bars from this company before. I think I shared it. We got this one bar that was like a tie-dye bar. It was white. Um, it looked, I wasn't sure if I was going to like it. It was probably the best chocolate bar I've ever had. I still think about the chocolate bar. Um, and so that's what this company is. I think it's called Compartes. I think they're out of California, if I remember correctly. These were delicious. So dark chocolate, sea salt, and pistachio. It says a new salted pistachio dark chocolate bar blends jumbo roasted pistachios with our signature dark chocolate and is finished with a sprinkling of sea salt. Okay, 
The next thing we have in here, these are our self-care items. So we have a flower power, oh, shower. Ooh, that's the prettiest shower steamer I've ever seen. I love the packaging. Love that. It says, empower your day daily self-care routine with a naturally derived dose of peace and love using this invigorating shower steamer from Feeling Smitten. Okay, that's lovely. All right, then the next thing we have is a face mask. This is from Master Lab. It's a hyaluronic acid hydrate, hydrating face mask. Oh, by Tony Moly. That's gorgeous. It says our Master Lab sheet mask collection features an ultra thin hydrating sheet mask made of natural cellulose for even and consistent absorption of active ingredients. Okay, and then last but not least, this month it was, this book came out in hardback. So here's the book, Lessons in Chemistry, and they actually hand do their wax seals. Isn't that cool? I was watching one of her Instagram stories and she was saying that they were, um, they were making all the wax seals for next month's book and she just had them lined up on a table. It was really cool that she takes the time to do that. So that was the book for April. Now also she does have like past books sometimes available or past boxes or past books if you want to add those to your box too. Man that was really good. I'm in love with the shower steamer. It's the prettiest isn't it? Kind of retro packaging. So I can't wait to dive into that one. So this one must be my May, yes, my May box. And it looks like this. And she does this for every single book. So every single book may have different items in it. Um, you're gonna get items that are gonna feel specific to your book that you pick. So I chose Something Wilder by Christina Lauren. And it says, growing up, the daughter of notorious treasure hunter and absentee father, Duke Wilder, left Lily without much patience for the profession or much money in the bank. But Lily is nothing if not resourceful and now uses Duke's coveted hand-drawn maps to guide tourists to fake treasure hunts through the Red Rock Canyons of Utah. I remember reading the synopsis of this and I'm so excited to dive into this one. It just sounded really good. Here's our custom bookmark for this one. What's pretty with the mountains, isn't it? Whether he was aware of it or not, he was looking at her like she was the prize at the end. That's the way you want your husband to look at you, right? <laughs> I love that. Okay, let me open it up. I'll just kind of give you an idea what it looks like here. There's a little postcard. I wonder if that's one of our items. Now, is this one a paperback? Yeah, oh no, this is a hardback too. I thought maybe this would be one of our extra items. I think this is just a little throw in because it's not in the menu of items that you can get. But isn't that gorgeous? Perfect. I love to just throw those right in the pocket of my suitcase when I get them and that way they're ready when I need them. Okay, so we have our candle for this month. Looks like this. They always say um, it's about to get lit or <laughs> I will say I met her at conference, Natisha, who's the owner of this box. And you know how sometimes you see people and you think in your head, she's so cute. And at other times you meet people and you're like, she is gorgeous. I've never met someone who is like a combination of both just adorable but gorgeous at the same time. Um, she told me that she likes the dark and twisty ones, which I never would have expected. But I mean, you walk away and she's just wicked smart. She's a mom with two kids. And I did ask her, I said, how do you pick the box, the books? And she said, I read a ton of them, but a lot of times at the last minute, I just have to go with my gut. And she says, it just works with me. And I have to say every single book that I've ever received in this box, I really, really liked. Okay, so this candle is called Duke's Tree. It's an agave and amber candle. Ooh. Let's smell this one. Let's see what's on the top of this one. This one's got some rocks on it too. Mmm. Mmm. That amber is like sharp. There's something else in here. Let's read about it. It says, our candles are always hand poured in the authentic book studio with non-toxic ingredients. It's got sweet agave, aloe, and amber. I wonder if the amber, the amber's very, very light. Sorry, I just put that on my desk a little hard. It's very pungent, not in a bad way, but it's a strong amber. Nice. Okay, then we have, I think I got a cracked cocktail again. Y'all, I'm so happy for these. I love them. 
So it looks like this one is from Portland. There's my handy dandy box cutter here. Y'all, just FYI, um, a bunch of you, after I mentioned this box cutter, I think it was the last video, were like, thank you for mentioning it because it wasn't on your Amazon shop. So yesterday I took the, took the day and I totally updated my Amazon shop. So if I ever talk about anything like this shirt is from Amazon, um, you can always find it. It's always in the description box. My Amazon shop, this is on there, my clothing, whatever. Um, anyway, that's a side note. Ooh, a spiced cranberry. This is pretty too. Is this the same company? Yes, this is the same company. Spiced cranberry syrup. That would be fun to like say for like a Thanksgiving cocktail, wouldn't it? Um, it says our spiced cranberry syrup includes a classic pairing of cranberries, ooh, plums, and traditional mulling spices. It is the perfect combination for a mulled wine when you need to warm up or a simple sangria when you need to cool down. Simply mix with sparkling water for a refreshing spritzer. Doesn't that sound good? Or the loose leaf tea was a spiced Bombay chai. And it actually came in a bottle. I've never seen them do that before. I bet that was lovely. Spiced Bombay chai. I might have to check that out. I'm a chai girl. Okay, the next item in here is by Rugged, and this is a body wash. Since it looks like they're gonna be out and about in the wilderness looking for treasure, Rugged sounds like it's right up the box's alley. Ooh, that's good. Ooh, hmm, that smells like a clean man. Mm-hmm. I love those. Okay, it says, we now offer our much-loved body wash in a travel size. It's now easier than ever to take your favorite body soap on the road or on the plane with you. And it's by a company called Simplified Soap. Okay, then we have this little guy. This is by Little Moon. And this is, I don't usually use curse words, but this is called Tired Old Ass. <laughs> by Little Moon Essentials. It says, kick exhaustion's butt with this mist. This astringent and invigorating blend re revitalizes you from harrowing work days, demanding deadlines, excessive exercise, or any bad energy that may come your way. It's energizing essential oils, spark the brain and juice up the body, leaving you feeling refreshed and ready. Okay, let's try this. I love the mister on this, it's super fine. Mm -hmm. It's got those essential oils. Mm. I don't pray this everywhere. It just smells really fresh and clean. And it is kind of a brightening scent. So it just makes you feel like energized and happy. Well, that feels really good. This would be great in the refrigerator. Okay. The next item in here is a bath soak. It's called Desert Days Wild Yonder Botanicals. I, I couldn't get over the packaging of this. I love this packaging it's very 70s retro isn't that cool okay it says enjoy a quartz charged sea salt epsom salts and dynamic honey and organic essential oils pedigrade neroli and pinion pine a multi-sensory botanical self-care you can use it you either use this for a soak like just soak your feet or you can use it as a, ooh, a body scrub Nice. Okay, see everything in here is, I feel like it's the best self-care, it's right up my alley. And then let's talk about the chocolat. <laughs> this is a Southern Artesian small batch company. It's called Olive and Sinclair, and this is called Coffee Crunch. So slow roasted and stone ground in Nashville, Tennessee. Isn't that cute? It says the fudgy backbone of our 67% chocolate with hints of redstone fruit ooh, and brown butter mixes and matches perfectly when studded with freshly roasted coffee from our friends at Bongo Java Roasting Company here in Nashville. I love when boxes highlight small businesses that you wouldn't normally get to see because they don't have, you know, the marketing power to get out to everywhere. Okay, and then here's our book. And again, this one was a hardback. This one's so pretty, isn't it? I kind of am excited for this because I've picked a lot of like beach reads and things. Um, and so I wanted to see, yeah, my little fax symbol came off. 
goes right here. Whoops, I put it on backwards, upside down. There it goes. So there's the wax symbol. <laughs> I've gotten a lot of like beachy reeds for the summer. And so I'm actually excited that this one's going to be more like wilderness. New York Times bestselling author of The Soulmate Equation and Unhoneymooners. I loved that book. Did you guys read that book? That was really good too. I think it might have been in my authentic book box and they're making it into a movie. That was a, such a good book. So something wild. So I forgot to tell you in both of them that if you keep flipping through, they talk about each of the small businesses, but they also give you a recipe for your cocktail and a story eat based on the book that you are reading. So here is the other one. We have brownies for one and a book cocktail. So don't forget to thumb through when you get your brochure and check out those recipes too. So those are my authentic book boxes for April and May. I will do the June as soon as I get it. Um, hopefully it'll be the first of next month. I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, if you want to try it, I have my discount code that I will link down below and I will see you tomorrow for another video, guys. Bye-bye.